Hello. Hello. Hi. We are the Mueller family. We're so excited that you guys are here. We're going to give you a tour of the inside of the house, check out the kids' rooms, just tell you guys a little bit about our family. So let's go get started. Hello, my name is Lauren Mueller. I have been married to my husband, Dennis, for almost 13 years, and we have four kids together. We live in Canyon Lake, California, and we love it here. I'm Dennis Mueller. I'm 34. I live in California. I have a wife and four awesome kids. Um, for a living, I design greenhouses and automate them. Plants has always been a big passion of mine, so I went to school for plants, and. As you can see, we like to guard it big time. So giant pumpkins, watermelons, lettuce, grapes, bananas, we grow it all. What do you think our parenting style is? Our parenting style is not firm enough, number one. <laughs> no. Yes. Um, I think we are very clear in what our boundaries are, but we're very open to let you guys explore and have fun and not be overbearing on you. But when you cross the line, then we definitely address that. Yeah. Yes, I think that we expect a lot from our kids, but that we also like to have fun with our kids. And yeah, that we have firm boundaries on what you can and can't do. But as long as you're in the boundaries, we're having fun. Yeah. Do, do you guys agree with that? What do yeah. you what what would you describe our parenting style as? Um, you guys are like strict but fair, like when you're not good. <laughs> but we, we, we can all have fun together. Who's the strict parent? You. you. What? Yeah, Dennis yeah. James is. Very black and white. Yeah. Which is so funny because you're kind of like the Disneyland dad too sometimes. You buy them stuff. Yeah, it's like you're both. <laughs> Just don't cross the line. Exactly. Yeah. Very clear. <laughs> what about mom? Is she pretty gray? Or is she black and white? She's, She's like more, in the middle. She's more like fun, but like she's so strict. I, like, I, can, I can take that. You're like so strict when we're back. Daddy, <laughs> when you're back. Can I turn that off? <laughs> okay, so what do you guys think sets us apart as a family? Mm -hmm. Why do everybody look at dad? <laughs> they all want me to go first. <laughs> yeah, you first. I think what sets us apart is we all want to be successful. We train that. So naturally, we're very competitive. Yeah. <laughs> From a young age, we always want to win games, and this is this is a perfect role for us because it's the next level of winning a game, right? Yeah. yeah. We already know we're gonna win it, but we have to we have to prove it to the yeah. public, right? I think we're good at working together. Absolutely. Yeah. And we can like get tasks done. We're good at getting it done. So I think that we're really good at getting things done, working together as a team. We're all super smart. You guys are both like the top of your class. Daddy's super smart. I'm super smart. That goes without saying. <laughs> Puzzles, so. agility, strength. And strength. we all yeah, have almost, like different abilities. Yeah, so we, we all can work all together. use them together to totally. like. We make a good team. Yeah. Totally. Nobody has a chance. No. Yeah. I think we could totally win. Yeah. No, okay, what are our biggest hopes and dreams for our kids? I'll let you go first again, and I'll try not to cry when I answer. For the kids? Yeah, for our kids. I think just letting them be creative and harboring that, but winning. And I <laughs> <laughs> right? Like, just be the best at whatever you want to be, right? Yeah. And I see Ethan developing into maybe like a pro... Gamer. <laughs> Gamer, sports, like you're pretty good at soccer, baseball. Yeah. I think Ethan has the ability to be a professional athlete or something professional. <laughs> and I see Aubrey as smart and talented and organized. I see you as maybe pre, I guess my aspiration for you is to have like a very professional job and graduate college. I know you're going to be top. Because you're a straight-A student anyway. <laughs> but that's kind of my vision for them. It's like, I think Ethan will get through school and be a good student. 
His sister will be top of her class, too. I have straight A's, too. Athlete, intellect. That's my final. No. And, and, I, and I hope that they both launch early in life with our coaching. Okay, well, without getting too deep or too cryy-ish as a mom, my biggest hopes and dreams, some of them, a few, just to touch on it, my biggest hopes and dreams for my kids is that you're surrounded by love in your life and that you find joy in, like, things in life and that you are kind to other people. Those are my hopes and dreams for you guys. I don't care if you're the best at things. I want <laughs> you to just be happy and, and nice to people. So it's a good mix. Such a mom answer. I know. <laughs> there you go. Okay, this is one of our favorite rooms in the house to hang out. It's me and Dennis's room <laughs> with our big comfy bed and we have movie nights in here with the family. I'm always finding kids sneaking into my bed. Sleeping the night. At all hours of the night. But so we wanted to show you our room. We love it. Even though we have kids in it, it's kind of like our little sanctuary. And I wanted to find out what is everyone most passionate about? What are your passions in life? Hmm. Dennis, you can go first again. Yeah. That's just the trend. I'll lead it off. I think my <laughs> passions in life are not to let it go by too quickly. So work hard to play hard. And okay. like, we all have to go to school and go to work, right? But as soon as school's over, as soon as I'm done with my work day, we're getting after it, right? Climbing a mountain, wakeboarding, mm -hmm. digging for gold, doing something. So we, we want to fit as much life in around what we have to get done, right? Yeah. That's, that's my goals. Okay, well. My biggest passion in life is my kids and raising you guys to be good people and making a cozy, happy home for you and spending time with my husband and my babies. And that's really my biggest passion. But I'm also passionate about adventuring and exploring with you guys. I can't wait to travel more and just do fun things together. That's my passions. What are your passions? Aubrey. <laughs> no. What do you love? What do you love to do? Um, I love to travel. You love to edit I, videos? I just love to be like creative and yeah. craft stuff and adventure. <laughs> yep, we're an adventuring family for sure. Eth, what about you? Um, I'm passionate about my family and your sports. Yeah, my sports for sure. Which are what sports? Baseball, soccer, golf, <laughs> football, and fishing. And fishing. Yep. Lots of sports and lots of adventure. Those are some pretty cool passions. Yeah. Sounds like a lot of fun. <laughs> Hey, I'm Ethan and I'm 10 years old. This is my room and I'm going to be showing you a few things that one of, that are like my favorite and what I'm passionate about. So first, I want to show you my soccer trophy. This was a while ago. Then I have a few, oops, I have a few medals like golf, another golf, and some more baseball. And I have all these baseball things up here. I have this little badge. And then over here, we have my bunk bed, which I built with my dad. I, I sleep on the top, and my brother sleeps down here. Me and him built it, and it was a lot of fun. And also, I picked this amp antler up off the ground when I was on a trip with my dad in Utah. So that's my room. Hi, I'm Aubrey. I'm 12 years old and this is my bedroom. Um, I like to keep it pretty simple in here because I have a big family and this is just my space. Something I'm really proud of is this wall decor that I made with my friend. I saw it really expensive online and I decided that I could probably make it and I made it for less than $5. Um, I really love to read and film my own YouTube videos. This is just my hangout space where I hang out and chill. Okay, so I am a blogger and a social media influencer for a living other than being a mom to four kids. And Dennis works from home also. So it gets a little crazy. Sometimes we're both <laughs> working, Keep it down over there. working in the same office. But this is kind of what a typical day in the life looks like. I get up, feed the kids breakfast, 
get them going on their daily activities and I'm in here on my computer doing emails and blog posts. Dennis is over here working on his stuff. We're trying to keep the kids from pounding our door down while we're getting some work done. Absolutely. So this is Dennis's office. Here he is in his natural habitat. His one quiet... This is where I live. One quiet place in the whole house. It used to be the garage, so now it's upgraded to an office. Yeah. So, yep, see we already have kids sneaking in on us. So this is where we this is where all the work gets done. Nice job. Home run. Okay, Ethan's getting ready to pitch to daddy. Here we go. Dennis, you gonna hit it out of the park? No, just warm up. Uh huh. <laughs> Here we go. Holy moly. Out of the park, baby. Hang on. Let's see how fast you can run, old man. Okay. First, first person to touch my hand. First person to daddy at second base wins. On your marks. Get set. Let's go. Hold her up. Turn it. Oh, he cut you inside. Go, 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 go. Aubrey by a hand. Aubrey won. Okay, I need a word from the winner and the loser. Um, he's a loser. Ethan, a you she let your sister touch. take you no, down. No, she didn't even touch first. Oh, burn. This, this guy thinks he can beat the kids. Getting kind of old, aren't you? Yes. All right, let's see it. Here we go. They're getting a little scared. Okay, let's do this. Who's counting it off? I'm counting you down. On your marks. Get set and go. Oh, he's so far ahead of them, they're not even trying. You got it in you after all. Okay, so if we're gonna race, we need to on mark. Get set. Go. Such a beautiful place to live. Okay, we're about to hike to the top of that hill. There's a flag at the top. Are you guys ready to take on the hill? Yep, yeah. we've done it like a million times. Oh, Dennis is stretching. He's really getting ready over there. Okay, here we go. Top of that hill, we're coming for you. Dun, dun, dun.
Okay, you guys, we're more than halfway. There's a the flag up there. The kids are doing it. I'm so proud. Look how high up we are. It's crazy. Come really far. We're almost there. Let's do this, you guys. We're almost there. Let's go. Let's go guys. Getting steeper. Go mom. Is that the team captain leading up there? Yeah. Let's go captain. He's leading the way. The flag is coming. Let's go. I'm waiting on you guys. There's home. Okay, let's go back down, guys. You ready? Guys, I see our car all the way down there. Do you see it? We made it to the top. Good job, kids. High five. Woo! We did it. You can barely see the lake in the background. Team Mueller is ready for anything. Do you guys think we can win? Mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely. Ethan thinks for sure. They have we're no gonna chance. Win. No chance? Yeah, they have no chance. What's going to be your strongest category, though? Mine? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's probably the physical. agility. The agility? You sure? Yeah. Who are we sending in for physical challenge if they pick that? Dad. Daddy. Mm -hmm. Daddy gets a physical. <laughs> <laughs> Ethan might be pretty squirrely though. <laughs> I know. Some of their challenges like that one, remember the cage is stacked up? You need to get through the cage, get the crystal ball. Mm -hmm. We gotta get picked first, let's hope they pick us. Yeah, they will. They'll pick us. Alright, hands in. Come okay. on. On three, one, one two, two, three. three. Yeah. 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 Yeah.